Hey, I'm Melissa. Today I'm gonna to give you a tour of St. Jude's award-winning and mom-approved maternity services. I chose St. Jude for my first child because it was close in proximity. I was terrified, to be honest, and then when I had my second, I chose it again because it was familiar and comfortable. With my third, fourth, and fifth, it just became home. I really knew nothing. I didn't know what to expect. I didn't know what it was going to be like. And then you keep having kids. They're all kind of different. You have different labors. And you still don't know what to expect. But St. Jude was always there to help me in every scenario. Literally, I think I've occupied almost every room here. <laughs> so this is where the babies make their debut. This is where you kind of get set up. My husband likes that area far away from me <laughs> when I'm screaming, <laughs> is that bad to say? It is really nice that this is spacious because you bring way too many things. So we brought like seven luggage bags that could all fit here. And you have your own private bathroom, which is nice. You're really comfortable for how uncomfortable you are. This is home to me. This is my comfort spot. I feel the most secure in this room because I know whatever happens, they'll take care of you. All my family would be waiting here in the waiting room and my husband would walk through those doors and he would give all the stats first and then tell them the gender, boy or girl. 19 inches tall, <laughs> seven pounds, two ounces. Oh. Oh. It's a little girl. <laughs> My favorite part because I would be in the room holding my little one and I would hear all my family scream tears of joy and I would look down and I would be able to tell that baby, you know, you are so loved already. So over here is the lullaby button. It's my favorite thing ever because after you have your baby, before you go into your room up here, you get to press this button and it plays a lullaby that circles all around the hospital so everyone gets to hear it. So this child that you've just brought into the world gets to bring joy to everyone in here. Like who couldn't smile when they hear that? It's the best. So this is the mother baby unit. It's where you come after you have your child. This is actually the exact room I was in when I had my first. So I remember <laughs> laying on this bed and my husband, who's a big guy, actually had enough space to sleep because I was trying to get to sleep after delivering a child and he was snoring and I said, hey, do you mind just waiting till I fall asleep? And he said, I'm sorry, I'm just exhausted. And I thought, all right, that's it, I'm a single mother. <laughs> The nurses, the staff, they were so helpful. They taught us what to do with a crying baby, how to soothe her, which was nice because even though people thought we knew what we were doing, we didn't and they were here to kind of pick up the slack. <laughs> Most couples don't consider whether a hospital has a top rated NICU or board certified neonatologist available 24 seven, but just know it's available here in case it's needed. Can I come in? Hi. So that's a uniform you definitely want to remember. It's their maternity concierge. Here at the hospital, they really understand that it takes a village. So this is a free service that they offer and she can get you whatever you want. If you want your favorite meal from your favorite restaurant, if you want balloons for your kids, if you want to send a card to anyone, anything you need, they'll do it. Here at St. Jude, they really know how to give you a warm welcome, which is all you could ever ask for. I hope you enjoyed your insider's tour. Before we go, I'll leave you with two things. First, definitely have your baby at St. Jude. And two, the laundry will always be there, but the newborn snuggles go by quickly. Good luck. <laughs>